Everyday News on Prince Amila Entertainment TV. Today is the 25th of October 2022. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here. And So guys, um, Zimbabwe Electoral Commission's uh, determination exercise for Harare was yesterday uh, characterized by heated clashes between ruling ZANU PF party members and those opposition citizens calling for change. Triple C activists forcing ZEC officials to halt the process for about 30 minutes. Supporters from both parties engaged in fist fights after ZANU PF provincial chairperson Godus Masimirembwa showed down a suggestion by Triple C members to increase wards in the capital. The Triple C members had proposed an increase of wards in Harare to 55 from 46, while ZANU PF wanted only 43 wards. The chaos forced ZEC officials to flee the venue at council chambers. Council security had to quell the clashes. The parties accused each other of passing supporters to the stakeholders meeting at town house. The Triple C party accused the NPF of turning the elimination exercise into a party rally. They had to hold a brief meeting, which was attended by ZEC officials. Arare provincial boss Fiona Kurima, security details and mayor Jacob Mafume to allow the meeting to go ahead. The situation I saw aside is not good at all. I have been struggled to negotiate my way through to my office. I can see there are drunk people. We have been passed to this meeting. Some people were not supposed to be here. This is only a stakeholders meeting, Mafume said. The meeting then became more chaotic after Masimirian Bar attacked the opposition labeling it failures. We can't increase the words when Arare City Council is failing. They've just failed on service delivery, Masimirian Bar said. Arare Council Denford Ngazore grabbed the microphone from Masimirian Bar saying he had turned the meeting into a ZNPF rally. This did not go well with ZNPF supporters who charged towards the podium in a bid to attack. Mafume had to retreat to his office while ZEC officials behind him. Riot and Municipal police had to be called in to restore order. Masimirian Baleta said that the Triple C party was being selfish. We are dealing with non performers and they are selfish. We also want the delimination exercise to be decided by performance. I believe that as a ZNPF representative, we are being victimized. I came here representing ZNPF and I ended up being victimized by the Triple C officials, he said. Kurima said they were looking forward to a fruitful meeting. In Bloya last week, 16 Triple C councillors walked out of the consultative meeting following a dispute over the number of words. Triple C had proposed 35 words while Zek presented only 29 words. And so guys, in a delimination exercise. And yeah, remember Kuti uh gender and area kuti one wakar is a photo wangani in the area. That's why I'm just now my word that is obvious because which means that our new Kumfakos or because my political parties they need to also uh, you know give their own views, their own opinion regarding to my suggestion to perform by say Pomira say, but you say, Baruma Kuru Akuru was Pakira because of a delimination exercise. Uh, and that these guys are supposed to be the leaders, they're supposed to be representing us in our communities. Why are we fighting each other? Why are we fighting each other because of political difference? Because we know ZANU PF, we know Triple C, Magbatana Power, Malagorana, Aumana. This is so embarrassing. And so, uh, this is a daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Mila in the TV. We'll be back here with more information. I want to watch more politics. One but a Jebasa and Israel. He won't be just Jebasa one minute and one book. Carapa and some book discuss. I go to what's the way forward. Not to go every time. I go to the politics and UPF triple C. Hey, Mimi Mata Tabasa. Hey, Mimi Maya Makawa and I say, Hey, I'm an Ashpere Mushi. And I so shame on those uh, people who are there. I feel like uh, they failed uh, to use that time to talk about Naya. The delimination is a go farm bira and it is a in a political party in a don't go discuss a connoti what's the way forward regarding to Jim Potter Bisco or to more many ones we're gonna have and it for my elections that go next year not 2023 but you'll be back here with more information uh this is a daily news breaking news everyday news on Prince Miller in the TV thank you for listening and watching bless up